It's speaking of that, so I'm all about mental health, bro. You know what I mean? Because all the shit we all done went through, just traumatized growing up how we done grew up. Like, you, you a street nigga by default. Right. Just live here, you know what I mean? So, what what makes you happy, bro? Like, just, if you're going to say, bro, this <laughs> this what makes me happy. Uh, Peace. Peace was making me the happiest right now. Like, like, I never knew how much chaos I was I was prone to. Yeah. Before I got to lead this shit. Yeah. When you leave this shit and come back, your perspective changed. Sure. So like, I never knew that every day, all day was chaos. Yeah. Beefing with them. This bitch acting crazy. Beefing at home. Yeah. This baby mama drama. Oh, this that. This that. Oh, Beefing man. with the police. Like, bro, I'm so happy to just be out and have peace. Swear to God. You feel me? Like, I'm on so many limitations, but it's making me like, like, it's just changing. Appreciate me, bro. shit you Hell didn't appreciate yeah. before. Hell yeah. So just peace, bro. Peace make me happy. Not no money. Not none of that bullshit. Peace. Relationships, yeah, and shit. Cause you are the bag, as you see. <laughs> you're ready to bag. You get as much money as you think about in your brain. Yeah, so yeah, you already realized it, that now after you even came back. That's it, my shit. Straight up, my shit switch. And that's that's all I can I can say for niggas. Peace, bro. All right. So so what does Indianapolis in its, in its entirety mean to you? Like it's the city of Indianapolis. Indianapolis is the shit. Yeah. Not for nothing. I was in there pushing for that shit. Y'all don't know who don't know what Napper nothing mean on Young Tone shirts. That's some prison shit, nigga. We had to put in work about that shit. Y'all think that shit just some uh, brand, some cool shit? Hell nah, I got sent to a whole nother penitentiary for war with niggas about that shit. I love Indianapolis. It's my home. I'm gonna put this bitch on the map. Yeah. Ask them niggas at Big Sandy, ask them niggas in the feds what little Billy was doing for Nap. Holding that bitch down so low. Two, three, four years before niggas even got there. We was on that. Nap is everything. It's the Circle City. It's, it's, it's the shit, bro. We get in that bag. You niggas really sleep on us. We get in that bag. What is the impact that you want to have on 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 the whole, on Indianapolis and the culture as a whole, like on the niggas that right now that's 10, 15 years old that's coming up in the same thing we done came up. What impact do you want to make on them? I want them to understand it's cool to, to be you. Be who you is. Don't get your life cut down short out here trying to be something you ain't. But I swear to God, nigga ain't gonna give a fuck about you. When you go to the joint, niggas don't give a fuck about you. All them niggas you popped, all this shit don't mean nothing. When you go in there, ain't no guns. So they are whole fucking just, just be you. You wanna be a motherfucking writer, be a writer. You wanna be a rapper, be a rapper. It's niggas like me that we out here every day putting this shit in. Every day. I'm in the hood every day. Like, Bruh, just do what you want to do, bro. Don't let no motherfucker put no limitations on nothing you can be. Don't let them put no time limit, no age limit on it. Just do whatever the fuck you want to do and be happy. If you want to be a motherfucking pastor, be a pastor. If you want to be a rapper, be a rapper. If you want to be a motherfucking pediatrician, go after that, bro. Because this life is not sweet and it's not easy. They say this shit easy money, bro. I got a whole arm full of dead motherfuckers who didn't make it, bro. I'm lucky. A whole arm, men and women. I got a little brother who got all day in the junk. Uh, this shit fucked up. So it ain't all sweet like you see all these chains and all these bullshit pants and shoes and shit. Cause the way you feel right now when you 10, when you 30, you not gonna feel that way. So shit, that's all I got to say. Other than that, love and loyalty. Nigga, we in the section. We out here. So you got any new music coming out, bro? I got that on. Crowd Hill 2 on the way. We got to be the hardest shit to drop. It's gonna be available on all platforms. I'm, I'm trying to get it together right now, right? I'm cooking it. But I don't want to rush it just to get them something out there. I don't want to rush it because this shit is a masterpiece. Y'all know how I'm coming, man. It's been five long ass years. Man. I'm about to fuck these people up. I'm about to fuck these people up. Then I got to do all the features and I got to find I gotta find the next upcoming talent. You know, that's what we do. Yeah. We put niggas in position. Yeah. That's Great shit, thing. Bro. Being a leader about putting niggas in position. Who you put in a position lately? You want to be a boss, tell me who you put in position. That's what we are. All right, man. I understand you on the time frame, bro. We appreciate you just sitting with us, man. You a for legend. Sure. We got major <laughs> love for you, bro. For sure. And it just feels good to even be home in Indianapolis, even sitting next to you, knowing you home, knowing you safe, knowing Definitely. you back with your family, raising right your jits, man. And uh, that's what it is, bro. Kiss Gang truly little Billy, man. Yeah, Fuck yes, yes. Yeah, Crown Hill section. Nigga Kenwood, 3600. Kiss Gang, let's get it. We in this thing. Yeah, it's about to go down. Here they come.
Hey, check out that weird wild good. thing from me, myself, and I come in and that Ken Wood Family Channel. It's about to go down. Free Lil Danny, Danny, bitch. It's about to go down. Free Lil Danny. Danny. Yeah. Free Sir. Yeah. Free Fat. Free Basic. Rest in peace, Booney. We need all that. Rest in peace. It's going down. We are in rest in peace, Jerry. It's going down. RP Big Skills. RP Big Skills. Fat. Free Fat. That's too many people. After this group was taken into custody, police say a search of the home in the 300 block of West 31st Street turned up drugs, a number of weapons and ammunition, along with more than $100,000 in cash. Bond is set for the men at $150,000 each. When I talk, what it is, podcast, every guest gonna break them off. Catch us on a block, every day we outside. This the kiss gang, huh? In connection with the tribe.